What do you need to see from Jalen Hurts that maybe puts him in that category where he's a MVP candidate? Or are you already there? Um, I think you need to see him do it in the playoffs. It's like all these guys, okay. you know? I mean, Patrick Mahomes, we saw do it in the playoffs, right? I mean, we've seen, um, you know, all, all the... Josh all Allen, the, Joe Burrow. Ones, yeah. Yeah, all, all the guys that got their team there. Um, and, you know, it's it's significant as well because this this Philadelphia Eagles team across the board, like when I was getting ready for the season this year, I just put the two lineups next to each other and you sort of went, you know, other than Dak probably being better than Jalen at this point in his career in preseason, then, you know, I'd, I think the Eagles have a better roster. So there is a certain thing that says, all right, well, how much do we have to pay Jalen, right? And are you going to go to 50 million? You know, I, I don't know. Mm. I, are we going to 40? Are we going to, th you know, where is it that we're going? Because the next alternative is, do you try and go find another quarterback in the draft? And that, that mindset I'm starting to hear more and more and more of around the league that, you know, if you're going to play the read option game, and especially now with all the concussion stuff uh, coming to the fore, are you going to have to have a couple of those kind of guys if that's what you want to play and you want to run your quarterback? Um, then, you know, there's there's just a lot of really interesting financial considerations that go into having a guy that's going to run, you know? And Josh Allen so far has been able to survive because he's so big. Uh, Jalen's been fantastic and he's been throwing a lot better. And occasionally now you'll see him sit in the pocket, read one out and make a throw. So I think the growth that he's making throwing the football has been sort of incremental. It has been very much an uphill, you know, uh, an uphill climb that he's actually learning to be the complete quarterback. And then at that point you go, all right, <laughs> here's your 50 million because he can do everything else. But I wonder why we don't have a, a soft, a softer landing spot, Chris, for these quarterbacks. Because if Mitchell Trubisky said, I'll take $25 million for three years with the Bears, is he still there? Uh, you know, we get this next guy up is going to get this amount of money. But, you know, if Baker Mayfield had taken less and said, look, I'll, I'll give me $25 million. But the ego gets involved with the quarterback and the agent. Therefore, it's either you get this, you get the bag, or, you know, you get the heave ho. Yeah, or you get Tom Brady in and he works for about 50% of what he's worth, right? Yeah. So it, it does all come down to that. And um, I, I think that, that as a quarterback, it's really hard to recognize where you fit because the game's evolving. I mean, there's no question about it. Lamar Jackson was an MVP in this league. If Jalen keeps going, who knows what he could end up doing in this league. I mean, they've got three receivers that can really play, and they've been putting up numbers in the passing game. Um, so it, it, it's it's possible that he gets there. But I think as, as a fan base, we all want to see him do it on a stage like this. Like this is – he did it. He played in the playoffs last year, got beat by Brady. They got behind. They couldn't throw the ball well enough to go come, make a comeback, right? Now you're going to see him in a – probably our highest rated game of the year uh, on Sunday night and playing the arch rival Dallas Cowboys. And does he rise up? And if they get behind, can he, can he bring them from behind? I mean, it's all the same stuff that they're going to do with, with any quarterback that's breaking in. Josh Allen was the same way, you know, when he first got there, Oh, he's not accurate enough to complete all the passes and he runs too much. And, then he's broken through. You know, I think Lamar's broken through. And now we'll see whether or not Jalen can.